Don't worry, Governor, I'm coming back for you. I'll save you, Elaine. I promise. I promise. Ahoy, mateys, and welcome back to The Secret of Monkey Island. Thanks for stopping by. I appreciate it. If you missed the last episode, a lot happened. We got into Governor Marley's mansion and got the idol we needed and quintessentially fell in love. We dug up the buried treasure that we needed to complete the three trials for the pirate leaders. But alas, our love, Governor Marley, was just kidnapped by the ghost pirate LeChuck. So now we've got to go get her back. If you've missed any of the playthrough up to this point, I encourage you to check out the playlist to get caught up. But in the meantime, I hope you enjoy this episode of The Secret of Monkey Island. It wasn't as bad as I thought, but... I gotta go get her. <laughs> I'm gonna pick up all these mugs. <laughs> Where's the pirates? I need to tell them that I... <laughs> that I did the thing. What's wrong, old sot? The governor is gone. LeChuck and his spectral crew came and got her. <laughs> they put her in the ghost ship and spirited her away. I saw that. She was so good to me. Always conveniently losing those health board <laughs> reports. <laughs> For a small consideration, of course. Of course. What'll become of my business? Oh, woe is me. <laughs> what can I do to save her? You must get a ship and go after her. The ghost pirate's lair is on Monkey Island. Everybody knows that. Yeah. Don't ask me how. <laughs> All you need to do is find a way there. Will you join me? I need to cook. Uh, alas, I oh, cannot come go on. to see an old war injury. I'm sure you understand. Where can I get a ship? Why, it's Smiling Stan's used shipyard. Same as everybody else. All Tell right. them I sent you. We're old friends. Old Stan. Get me a drink. Get your own drink. <laughs> All righty. Right. I'm off. Good luck. Be sure to wear your mittens. <laughs> okay. And your galoshes. And don't forget to write. Okay, bud. Bye now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Can I take the meat again? Just in case. Let's take one of our mugs. Looks like and a fine pewter tankard. Put some uh, garago in it. This stuff is eating right through the mug. Oh. Oh. Oh, I gotta go get the, uh, the guy out of jail. Quickly. Hurry up. Hurry. Guybrush, go. Hurry up, Guybrush, go. Faster. It's nearly gone. It's gone. I don't see anything special about it. Oh, I want to talk to this I guy. Help you? I was just on my way to the governor's mansion. Are you here for the looting? <laughs> yes. Yes. Looting sounds like fun now that I'm a pirate and all. And do you have reservations, sir? Of course. Why, yes, I do have reservations. And what name would they be under? It's probably under S, for Shine Top. 
nice pie, <laughs> but we're booked solid for the next five hours. Hmm. Mm, but I might be able to squeeze you in around the two o'clock hour. Would that be okay? Two o'clock. Got it. Yes, that would be fine. Super. I'll put you down for one to loot the governor's mansion at 2.30. Okay, so how am I going to get... This grog's going to melt through the entire cup by the time I get to the, the guy in the... in the in the prison so maybe I have to <laughs> switch the cups as I go <laughs> okay let's use this with this <laughs> oh, no, wrong way. Okay, good, got it in a fresh cut. Got another fresh cup. Hurry up. Get it? Hey, great! A drink! <laughs> yeah. I'm real thirsty. Yikes! Wow! Got you out, I buddy. I think I used to drink that stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thanks. You're welcome. If there's anything I can ever do for you. Well, actually, there is something. Mm -hmm. I'm looking for brave people to join my crew and sail off to Monkey Island with me to rescue the governor. She's been abducted by the fearsome pirate LeChuck and is being held against her will somewhere in his secret hideout. I see. <laughs> well, Jess, mmm. LeChuck, you say. Well, Jess? Yes, of course. We must sail to Monkey Island and... <gasps> hey, look behind you! I three had a monkey! Oh, come on, guy. I saved your life. I can't believe I fell for that. <laughs> Pretty good trick, though. <laughs> I'll remember that one. I think it's welded shut now. Welded shut? What's happening Having here? just returned from Melee, LeChuck and his crew find their old hiding place in the underground rivers of Monkey Island and drop anchor. Fester. Captain, sir. I just stopped by to congratulate you on your kidnapping mission. Captain. Oh, Captain, you I dirty know. dog. It was all an act. Never felt better. <laughs> and how fares our prisoner? Ah, yes, the uh, prisoner. <laughs> we had a little trouble. Trouble! No, 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 nothing to worry about, sir. Everything's under control. She escaped a few times. A few well, times. Up in the brig. She wasn't very good at it, was she? No one's getting in or out of there. For your sake, I hope not. With years of planning almost destroyed by my death, I'm not taking any chances now. 
You took care of Mr. Threepwood then? Guy Brush Threepwood will not be a problem. Oh yeah, because he threw me in At the ocean. At this very moment, he's 20 feet underwater. Probably bloated up like a fattened pig. <laughs> his eyes being eaten out by crabs. Ooh. Fish pecking at his fingers. Kind of makes you wish you were there to watch. A little bit. Ah, yes, sir. <laughs> sure does it that. Now, go check on the route. Make the sure route. it's locked up tight. Aye, aye, Captain. All right, where we need to go now? Oh, well, we need to get a ship, but I wonder if we need to see that lady again. Now that we've got the, basically got the three things completed. I don't think I need anything in the store. Can I look in here? We never were able to do anything in here. Still doesn't look like there's anything to do. All right, let's go see if we can um, visit the voodoo lady again. I think she's in here. Hello. Hey, I'm back and I'm ready to know more about the future. There she is. So you have returned to learn future. Yes, I must go after the governor. I see you with some others willing to help in your cause. Yeah. I really hate that flashing. <laughs> it makes me see spots. Quiet. I am getting another vision. You must. Must what? You must go to Monkey Island. Once I already there, knew that. You will search for the ghost pirate LeChuck. He hides deep, deep beneath Monkey Island. Okay. There is only one thing powerful enough to destroy LeChuck. What is it? What? It's an ancient root. Oh. Once prepared, the root can destroy a ghost with one touch. Yeah. I'm getting more, more vision. I see the cannibals that live on the island. Okay. They are helping you okay. or eating you. Oh. <laughs> I can't tell. The vision isn't coming in clear anymore. Well. Great. <laughs> now go and find the one that loves you. But be warned. Don't worry. I'll watch out for LeChuck. Not of LeChuck. Of yourself. What you will find out about yourself and your world, it will terrify you. Oh, creepy. All right, so that's the route that LeChuck was talking about. I guess I just need to go over to Stan and get a, uh, a boat. Stand my man and we're coming, dude. Keep going, guy brush. You're walking so slow today. Um, uh, where? Oh, here it is. Howdy. Hey, Stan. I'm Stan of Stan's previously owned vessels. <laughs> and I'd stand on my head to make you a deal. All what right. sort of craft are you looking for? The best Big, you got. Fast, slow. You want it? I got it. And if I don't got it, I'll get it. I want to make you a deal that you're happy with. Because if you're not happy, I'm not happy. Sure. But I know you're going to leave here happy today. How do I know? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, take a look around. So tell me, <laughs> what are you interested in looking at today? Uh, 
All right. Let's try not to waste too much time. Let's go with um, not too expensive, but Something built to not last. Too expensive, but built to last. Affordable quality. Yes. Hey, that's my motto. I've got just the boat for you. Walk this way. Now I can see you're a no frills kind of guy. But I can also tell that quality means a lot to you. I mean, just look at the way you dress. <laughs> Rugged, like this baby. She comes from a land far to the north, where the sea is as unforgiving as the men are tough, and hey, you wouldn't happen to be from there, would you? You just seem to have a sort of Nordic quality about you. Anyway, we're talking about a real value here. What kind of price range were you thinking of? Um, let's see. Actually, I was hoping to get one on credit. Sorry, kid. Neither a borrower nor a lender be. Come on. That's just old Stan's philosophy. If you've got a job, the storekeeper in town might extend you some credit. Then we'd have something to talk about. Unless, okay. of course, you've already got some other means of financing. No, I don't think so. I have 371 pieces of eight. I'm glad this ship doesn't have ears, my friend. Because if she did, she'd slap <laughs> your face. I slap bet you're your carrying face. enough cash on you for this transaction. You wouldn't happen to have any other means of finance, would you? No, I wouldn't. On second thought, this may not be the ship for me. Well, heck, I can understand that. Nothing wrong with being indecisive, even if it is a waste of my time. So, what else can I show you? Um, we're gonna need some credit, so... Actually, I'd like to go think about it some more. Sure, sure, think it over. I don't want you to feel pressured or anything. Bye now. Yeah, let's go over, because he said we have to talk to the shopkeeper to get some credit, so I let's... Forgot to give oh, you geez, Stan, where'd you come from? And here's something else to remember me by. A compass? A An compass. An extra strong magnetic compass. That could come in handy. On it. <laughs> That's right. It always points directly back here. So if you're oh. looking for a good deal, you know where to go. I'll be right here when you come back. A little but free advertising for Stan. I guarantee that any of these ships will. Right. They're moving fast today. I can see that. Yes, sirree. Can't hardly keep anything in stock. He'll All right. Back. Yeah, we will. Back to the store. Don't worry, Governor, I'm coming back for you. I'll save you, Elaine. I promise. I promise. And when I make a promise, I never break a promise. I promise. And when I promise something, I never, ever break that promise. Ever. All right, all right. Back to the store we go. Hello. I should have known it'd be you again. The Swordmaster says you can jump in the lake, <laughs> by the way. Okay. What do you want? I want a credit card. I'm interested in procuring a note of credit. You are? I, uh, you got a job? Yes, of course I do. Yes, of course I do. All right. <laughs> I'll get one of my notes and we'll fill it out. <laughs> I love that. That's how credit works. You have a job? Sure. Okay.
Now, let's see here. What did you say your occupation was? I'm an acrobat with a traveling circus. You're one of them fettuccine brothers? Where's your silly accent? And where are your silly slippers? Oh, come on. Come back when you got a job in a credible business. And she didn't see me get shot out of the cannon. What else do you want? Um, I need you to leave. I'm looking for the Swordmaster of Melee Island. Yeah, like I'm gonna fall for that one again. Oh, please. I won't steal anything this time, I promise. Hmm. I guess I could hike all the way over there again. Be right back. Thanks, buddy. I've got my eyes on you, weasel boy. Don't try anything. I'm not going to do anything except for steal. Your, your little thing here. Let's see. Um... Oh, I don't want to do that. I'm confused what the pulls and the pushes do. There we go. There's nothing Got in it. here but this note. Take it. I guess let's just get out of here. Go back to Stan the man. I wonder if we need to go back to the governor's mansion at all. Did you know the governor's been kidnapped? Uh, well, yes, we knew about that. Do you care? <laughs> Can I interest you in a dream vacation on Monkey Island? Why are you just standing around instead of doing something about it? <laughs> I love uh, the way they deadpan the camera. Well, the governor could probably take care of herself. Probably. And we are sort of busy here. Yeah. Yeah, I, I can see and that. We've got the circus to think of. We've got to find the elephant. Find the rat. <laughs> Yeah! And get rid of these minutes! I'm sorry. We simply can't go at this time. I'll just be running along now. All right. They, they don't want to help me, so... I don't know what I'm supposed to do about that. I guess go back to Stan, get a boat. And then I need to get my crew, which is going to be at least that that guy on um, Hook Island. He said he would go with me. Probably need to find at least one other person. I bet I can talk that uh, prison prisoner into coming too if I can find him again. Howdy! Howdy! Great to see you again. I knew you'd come back. Of course you did. Everybody does. You know why they come back? Just look at all these ships. I've got something for everyone. Come, <laughs> take a look around. So, what else can I show you? Who 
me see the best ship you've got. Hey, it's nice to meet a man who appreciates quality. I've got just the boat for you. I mean, if we've got Walk credit, let's way. just see what we can get, right? Now this, this is a ship fit for a king. Is I it? I mean, we're talking 15 staterooms, a fireplace in every one. We're talking two pools, one indoor, one outdoor. It's a cruise ship. We're talking rotating ballroom. Oh. We're talking heated crow's nest. <laughs> we're talking 200 feet of ocean-going decadence. And all for one low price. Speaking of price, just how much were you looking to spend today? Um, I got credit from the storekeeper. Will you take it? I'd love to. Okay. I really would. I usually do. Come on now. But not for the amount this baby's going to run you. Maybe one of the other ships would be more in your price range. All right, Stan. So, what else can I show you? Could I see that Viking one again? I knew it. I <laughs> knew it. Just can't get her out of your mind, can you? Walk this way. Can't keep your eyes off her, can you? Nope. She's a beaut. How much would you like to spend? I got credit from the storekeeper. Will you take it? I'd love to. I really would. Stan. I usually do, but not for the amount this baby's going to run you. Maybe one of the other ships would be more in your price range. So, what else can I show you? Well, I mean, I guess it's going to be this one, isn't it? that much to spend have no fear every ship I sell is a bargain mm -hmm. but if you're looking for a real steal I've got just the boat for you walk this way this here is the famous sea monkey the only ship ever to make it to monkey island and come back with anyone aboard left alive. Ooh, or should I the say monkeys, right? anything? You see, the previous owners of this ship were two adventurous pirates. They set off, like many before, to find the legendary secret of Monkey Island. And like many before, they disappeared forever. Yeah. Their fate? A mystery. Almost as mysterious as how this ship returned to Melee Island without a single human aboard. Some claim it was sailed back by a crew of chimps. Chimps? There aren't any chimps in the Caribbean. Oh, shut up. It makes a good story. <laughs> it is Monkey Island, after anyway, all. Anyway, this baby's mine now. That is, until someone makes me an offer. What kind of price range were you thinking of? I've already told you several times what I have. I got credit from the storekeeper. Will you take it? Hey, of course. Here we Your go. Your credit's always good at stands. It doesn't matter if you've had credit problems in the past. Divorce, chronic gambling mishaps. I mean, who am I to judge, right? Right. If the storekeeper trusts you enough to give you a letter of credit, then you must be an honest man with a steady income, right? Right. right. <laughs> Let's get down to brass tack, shall we? I know you want it. You know you want it. And I know that you know that I want to sell it, so... Let's talk extras. Yeah. Throw in extras? some stuff for me. You Come on, Stan. Extras? Great! This baby's loaded with extras. Mm -hmm. For instance, did I tell you about the porthole debuggers? <laughs> Gee, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. 
That's why it's already included in the price. Oh, but brother. wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the anti-lock anchor? No. Gee, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. That's why it's already included in the price. How many days but have wait, you... There's more. Did have I you included? You about the rack and pinion rudder? Rack and pinion rudder. Gee, Stan, that does sound useful. Will this go on all day if and we just keep well doing it? the money, too. That's why it's already included in the price. But wait, there's <laughs> more. Did I tell you about the velour Ooh, sail covers? Velour. Gee, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. That's why it's already included in the price. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the tachometer? Tachometer. Gee, Stan, that does sound useful. And well worth the money, too. That's why it's already included in the price. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from burgundy wine casks? Okay, yeah, that does it. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. <laughs> Yeah, I guess that is kind of decadent, isn't it? But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? Oh, brother. All right, enough. Enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? Money. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I'd like to pay 2,000 pieces of eight. Sure, I'm sure you can't get a deal we can out of this out guy. You're going to have to pay the 5,000 no matter what. But day. I'm going to be getting a whole new shipment next week. So you got me over a barrel. <laughs> I've got to sell this baby, even if it means losing my shirt. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. Yeah, let's How just keep much? playing with it to see what the dialogue is. I'd still like to pay 2000 That's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction, you know. Just tell me, what would it take to get you to sail this ship away today? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? I'd still like to pay 2000 that's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction. Okay, so it's direction, just the same dialogue you know? if you keep you going. You realize, don't you, that they just don't make them like this anymore? I'd like to make you an offer. All right, let's see what the, the dialogue for the 3,000 pieces. Well, how does 3,000 pieces of eight sound? That's a little bit more like it, but not much. <laughs> I know you can try harder than that. Buddy, you can tell me the truth. It's the little woman, isn't it? <laughs> You're afraid of what she'll say when you come home with a new ship. Don't be such a wimp. Stand oh. up to her. She'll respect you for it. And when she sees this ship, she'll love you for it. Trust me. Yeah, I don't think so. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Does 3,000 sound any better now? That's still not enough money. Inflation works in the other direction. So it just you know? makes you go back I through the I thought original you were interested ones. interested in this ship. I'd like to make you an offer. All right, well, let's try the 4,000. I'm sure this isn't going to get it for us either, but let's... Okay, okay, 4,000 pieces of eight. Go ahead That's and get the dialogue out of it. Like it. But not much. I know you can try harder than that. Maybe you haven't realized the fact that this is the only ship lot on the island. Well, what do you think it's worth? You could sail this puppy away today for just 8,550 pieces of eight. How not does doing that, that sound to you? I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? All right, we'll do the 5,000. Actually,
Actually, I'd like you to squirm a little more. Sure. Hey, that's my job, isn't it? To squirm? I'm just thinking of my kids' <laughs> education. Of course you are, here. Stan. Oh, these salespeople are scum. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Five thousand. Right. That's all you're 5, getting. Five thousand, but that's my final offer. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder really? than that. Really? They're still not going to give it to me. You're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know. So. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? Uh, maybe it's the Let's extras, extras that he added in. Did I tell you about this simulated wood siding? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Okay, but I'm telling you, barnacles hate simulated wood. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the porthole defogger? Okay, that was the first one. So let's just take I all of those I can live off. That particular piece and of maybe junk. he'll do the 5,000 on it. Okay, but don't blame me if you run into an iceberg or something. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the anti lock anchor? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Sure, throw safety to the wind. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the rack and pinion rudder? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Well, I guess it'll float without it. Barely. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the velour sail covers? I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Hey, travel light. I can understand that, sure. Of course, mutiny is an ugly word. Mutiny. But wait, there's more. Did I tell you about the tachometer? Tachometer. I think I can live without that particular piece of junk. Wow. Does your wife know <laughs> you're such a cheapskate? She sure does, but and she wait, loves it. There's more. Did I tell you about the elevator made with wood from Oregon? All right, Oregon I think that's all of it. Cast? So let's let's try and make an offer again. And enough about extras already. Okay, where were we? And get this boy. I'd like to make you an offer. Off our case here. Great. How much? All right, five thousand. But that's my final offer. That's a little bit more like it, but not much. I know you can try harder than that. Nope. Pretty soon you're going to have to make me a serious offer, you know. I'd like to make you an offer. Great. How much? 5,000. And that's my final, final offer. 5,000 pieces of eight. Can I take it? Okay. Okay. About okay. time. It's killing me, but okay. And I thought I was gonna give my children Christmas presents this year. Oh, your poor kiddos. Just take it out of here. You're not married. I'm glad to get rid of it. Oh yeah, do you have that note from the storekeeper on you? I do, I do. He didn't fill it out though. Thanks. I've got to run these numbers by my boss. He'll think I'm nuts, but I'll talk him into it. You meet me at the dock with your crew. Okay. I'll bring the ship and the papers. I just want to say that I really feel like we got to know each other today. <laughs> I mean, I really felt some bonding We here. did something. And I don't just say that to everybody. It's been great doing business with you. Really? Sucker. <laughs> See you at the dock and don't forget your crew. All three of them. What a guy. Three of them. Okay. All right, let's get out of here. So who would the third one be? Um, it wasn't the guys at 
the what's that place called the, the three pirate guys who are part of the PTA or whatever it wasn't those guys no it's not going to be the map guy the cook said no I, I'm sure the prisoner is one of them as far as the other one, it's either going to be Carla or the guy that, that Captain Spark, that guy that trained her. Let's get this guy. Uh, where's my chicken? Here it is. Hmm. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. Hmm. I think it could support my weight. I said, use it. We gotta go get Meat Hook. That's his name, right? Meat Hook. Hey, buddy. You ready to go? I told you. I don't have the time to show you any more tattoo tricks. The governor's been kidnapped. What? That's preposterous. That's true. Oh, really? Take a look at this note they left. Oh, no. This is horrible. What are we going to do? I'm going to go get her. We could get a crew together and sail off after them. Yeah. Come on, bud. What an idea. Now, if we only had a cannon. Uh, that would be me, me, obviously. <laughs> you? <laughs> <laughs> it's not that funny. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Hey, I'm serious. Really? <laughs> really? Okay, let's see you prove it. Okay. Walk this way. There's something in here that I want to show you. Is it Roger? Something horrible. Something so horrible that I stay awake at night just thinking about it. But I don't mean to scare you. I'm sure a big, brave guy like yourself will have no problem facing this monster. Just open the door. All, it's much smaller than the beast that bit off my hands so many years ago. Arr, mm. arr, arr, arr. Let's just hope you're quicker than I was. Oh, I just remembered something. I never did get around to feeding him this week. Oh, brother. <laughs> Silly me! I'll let you open this last door yourself. Okay. Just let me get out of your way. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Getting cold feet? No, I just don't know what I'm supposed to do. Yeah. You're supposed to open that little door. And if you're brave enough, touch the beast inside. Oh, is that all? All right, let's do it. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> if you've got the guts. I've got guts. It won't budge. It won't budge. <laughs> Whoa, what is it? <laughs> uh. I don't believe it. He's a good boy. You are a brave man <laughs> after all. You faced the beast I've feared all these years. You Roger. had the guts to do what I never could. <sighs> I feel like such a coward. I'm not good enough to be on your crew. Come on, I'm buddy. I'm not even good enough to swab your de 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 <laughs> eggs. Oh, come on, Meat Hook. 
You're a big, strong, good-looking guy with a talking tattoo. Yeah. You can swab my decks anytime. Who doesn't want that on their crew? <laughs> really? Yeah. Sure. I can still be on your crew. Just pack your stuff and meet me at the dock. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I won't let you down. Are you sure? Hey, maybe I'll get a chance to show you my whole tattoo routine when we're at sea. Wow, this is sounding better <laughs> and better all the time. Can't wait, buddy. Can't wait. All right, let's get out of here. Can I get on my chicken. It's just like the one on the other side. Come on back over. Come on. There we go. I got it. Let's get out of here. Let's stop at the Swordmasters on the way and check with her. And then I'm going to see if I can find the prisoner again. Maybe he's back in jail. I don't know. This isn't Carla. Where, where am I? I don't want to go to the circus. She's over here. Nice, I have a direct path to her now. Oh, Carla, my Carla. Do you want to come with? We got some fun stuff happening. You've already got the t-shirt. What do you want now? <laughs> um. The governor's been kidnapped. What? Yeah, let's That's just ridiculous. not beat around the bush. Let's just say we need some help. Oh, no. This looks bad. Very bad. I'm getting a ship and a crew together to go rescue her. Hmm. I have a feeling I'm going to regret this. Nice. Count me in. I'll meet you at the dock. Okay. She already knew where to go. All right. Let's head back into town and see if we can find the prisoner. Maybe we need to go to the governor's mansion again. We have an appointment there, a reservation at 2, I think. But we at least need to try to find that guy. Wherever he is. Hey, Stan. Hey, it's a good thing you showed up. Ten people have offered to buy this baby off me while sure I've been have. standing here waiting for you. But I said, no way. I know a guy who's in love with this ship, and it would break his heart to lose it. Am I right? You're right. Of course I am. <laughs> I mean, just look at her. Sleek, aerodynamic, a buoyant barnacle-covered beauty. Stan's been drinking too much energy drink. <laughs> I think we're having a real moment here. <laughs> no, we're not. We're not. I changed my mind. Don't touch me. I can't give her up. Stan. You can have your money back. I'm going to shove you in the river. How could I sell something so dear? Oh. And then again, a deal's <laughs> a deal, right? Yeah. Right. <laughs> Good luck, yeah. I'm, I'm out of here. She's a real beaut. Whoops. I almost forgot to give you this free seafaring literature. My gift to you. Just remember where you got it. Stands! Who could forget? Maybe I should have gotten that extended hey, there warranty is. after all. Hey, long time no see. Partner. Have you come to be on my crew? Hey, I could never pass up a chance to make some easy money. Nice. Uh, money? Yeah, we are getting paid for this, right? Yeah. Go 
glad you could make it, Carla. Look, don't start with me, okay? So what's that waterlogged wreck doing out there? That's our boat. How are we going to get our ship in here with that pile of scrap in the way? Where's the cabin boy? I need him to go back to my place and pick up my bags. Me hook. Come what's on. going on here? Where's our ship? Where's our crew? This isn't going to be as easy as I thought. <laughs> All right, so we've got our crew, we've got our ship. That's going to complete part one for us. We'll look at part two, the journey, in the next episode, so make sure that you stick around. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, thanks so much for hanging around. I appreciate it. You guys are the absolute best. If you enjoyed it, leave a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. Either way, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.